just learned something that yeah. I really don't understand. What's that, Molly? And I need help with it. Okay. Okay, Miss Jen, I learned that some books are banned. Right. Which means that, well, I don't really understand what that means. Does that mean that the book is for musicians, for people who are in band? Like a banned book? Yeah, a banned book? Is no, that what it is? it doesn't mean that. I am here. Well, say who you are. I am Jennifer Cook, and I... That's Jennifer Cook, everybody. <laughs> oh, okay, so should we start? Should we start? If someone could just lift that. <laughs> that highlight. I love <laughs> So Miss Genevieve picks all the books in our store. She oh, is awesome. And so she's done a lot of research on banned book. We fly We don't have a fly Okay, then so, can so we talk to you about it though? Yeah, yeah, do, do. Okay. So there is a week during the year, and we're about to start it, mm -hmm. where we celebrate our right to read. Every year, at least 400 books that have been challenged or banned. We don't think any book should be banned. Wait, 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 wait. Are you telling me two things? One. Every year there's 400 new ones? 400, some new and some reoccurring. We think we should all be able to choose our own books. Mm -hmm. Now if you're a little kid like five, maybe you would have your mom or your dad or your grandma or a friend help you choose. On the list is always To Kill a Mockingbird. Okay, but To Kill a Mockingbird, the reason I know about that one because it was a movie. Yes, it was a very good movie. Very good. Yes. And then, yeah, Scott was dressed as a yam. I remember the yam. Mm -hmm. Or was it a was ham? It? But we should all be able to choose what we read, and nobody should tell us that we can't read things. And so that's what Banned Book Week celebrates. It celebrates our freedom to read, our <gasps> right to read. Yes, ham. OK, I don't understand. Like, who gets to decide? Yeah, I know. It's very <laughs> Who gets to decide? What we read, I mean, we read a book today about a dog that farts. If somebody might say, you can't read that book. Somebody might say because that. Because you shouldn't read stories because about dog gas. Exactly. Someone might say that. And then if they go and they get the government in their local town to agree, they would take those books out of bookstores and they would take those books out of the libraries. And we couldn't read about the dog who farts. What other books? That we other know? books that are banned. Actually, it's a book you know. You you read it today. It was Walter the Farting Dog. What? Walter's stomach was fine. He felt perfectly normal. He just farted a lot. <laughs> As you do. Why would you ban a dog? A, it's just dog gas. Every dog has gas. It's Every true. human has gas. You it's can't, a natural thing. You can't deny that. People didn't like that the word fart was used 24 times. What's a cavity? Uh, it's true. <laughs> it's true. And did you like that book? It was hilarious. It was so funny. That's a really good book. Yeah. Another book that's been banned is The Giving Tree. Do you know The Giving wait, Tree? Wait, wait. What? Yes, that makes no sense. Even Jonah's outraged. Yes. Come on in, Jonah. Come on in, Jonah. And The Giving Tree is about this beautiful tree it starts little and and it's growth and the growth of, of how relationships and how they change and the little boy and the man what what wait a second what it that's hard like how do i find a book if the book is banned how do you find it how am i gonna find it i know well this luckily a lot of books are banned but not everywhere maybe just in one little county of america and sometimes books are what? banned, but then other people come in and say they shouldn't be banned and the books are freed up again and we can read them. So it's a little confusing. We have a list of all the children's books that have been banned and there's some beautiful books in there. Do you know where the wild things are? That's another one that's been banned. But here in our bookshop, you can get a hold of really all of them. But do you know why? Does any, in any of this research, did they say why these people, like yes. they're, they have arguments? A lot of it is that people feel that it's unfit for children. Where the wild things are, particularly, has one child acting very badly. But the truth is, is kids act badly all the time. That's part of being a kid. Well, well yeah, because sometimes when you're little, you don't know you don't that you're know. acting bad, or if you do, I mean, you have to go, you got to go through things. It's true, and when you read Where the Wild Things Are, you learn a lesson, a lesson about being good and what you leave behind when you choose to act badly and 
making up for the bad things that you do. To, uh, let's say, tell them to, to tell the people there. So you can, the, there, if you go online, there's a lot of information on websites about banned books. The best website to start at is actually the American Library Association website. <gasps> Wait a second! Do you like libraries? Of course, I it's know. the library! Me too! If the library doesn't think it should be banned, they don't. Now, oh. So the place to start is the American Library Association website and I'm then gonna. find out about the banned books section and you can find history on banned books and you can find lists of banned books. So all these lists of books, are you going to have people come and read them? Or? We are. We have, there's, it's, it's called a readout. A and, readout. And we're hoping you'll do one for us. Okay. Where you read part of a book that has been banned and we take a video of it and then we post it. Mm -hmm. So that people can be aware of the books that are banned and they can see lots of different people reading them. So we're going to have about 10 people in our town of Katona doing readouts, including you. I'm excited about it. I know, this. it's very really cool. Exciting. Wow. Um, yep, all the bookstores join in. Wait, is there a book about banned books that was banned? You know, there probably is, Lolly, but I don't know what it is. Hmm. 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 Maybe you should write that book. <gasps> I wonder, hmm, I'm going to figure out what book I'm going to... You you're going to help me find the we book. We are, and Genevieve especially is picking one for you, I think. Thank you. Oh, you're, you're so welcome. <laughs> wow, this is great. So, you guys... This is a really beautiful place you have in your community. I mean, it's beautiful because of the candy, of course. Right. But it's beautiful because of the, the stuff that you do for people and you, you care and you want to share. That's really... We do. It's very powerful. Oh, thank you, Lolly. We oh. do. Thank you, sweetheart. Thank you for coming. Oh, thank you, Lolly. <laughs> <sighs> it's so touching. <laughs>